Hey, welcome to another episode of Joy Car Mods. My name is Jeff, and today I have a product review, installation, and demo of the switchback LEDs from Ala Lightning. All right, here is a close-up of the LED bulb. Each bulb consists of 36 3030 SMD LED chip. There are a total of 18 white and 18 amber. Now, this will be a direct replacement for your turn signal bulb, such as this one. This particular bulb for my vehicle is a 3157 socket. So this right here is a 3157 base. Now to install this LED bulb, all you have to do is go ahead and remove your original stock bulb and take your new one and insert it in its place. Now it is possible that when you insert it in like this and you plug it in, if it doesn't turn on, you just have to remove this and flip it around and insert it the other way just to make sure the polarity is correct. Now when you do change out your turn signal bulb to an LED bulb, you're going to get what's called hyper flashing. In order to fix that, you're going to have to do either one of the three things. You can go ahead and install resistors for each turn signal bulb socket that you swap to an LED. Now if you do decide to use these kind of load resistor, make sure you mount this on something metal. Don't mount it in anything plastic. Don't mount it anywhere near any wires or rubber hose or, or plastic containers or anything like that. And the reason being is that these things get really hot. Do not touch them with your bare hands. It will burn your fingers. These will melt through plastic. It will burn through rubber hoses and it will melt wires and things like that. So make sure you mount them away from any of that onto something metal. Or if you have a older vehicle or a vehicle that has the flasher relay that is accessible, then you can go ahead and change out your flasher relay to an LED compatible one and that will fix all four corners. Or you can install something like this, which is my plug and play resistor harness and it will fix your hyper flashing issue. All right, so here is the LED bulb installed on my front turn signal wire harness. Now make sure the bulb is inserted all the way into the socket and kind of feel around to make sure it's not loose. If this bulb does fall out into the headlight housing, you have to remove the whole bumper and the headlight in order to take it out. So just be careful, especially be careful when you do insert this and take this out of the headlight socket. Um, that's when this bulb might get caught and it'll come apart. Now I'm going to take this and insert it in here. And then turn it clockwise to lock it in place like that. Now go ahead and turn on your parking lights to verify that the white running lights work. And as you can see, it does. And then turn on your hazard lights to verify that the white turns off and only the amber blinks and which it does. So these are type two switchbacks. Amber on, amber off. Type ones are, it alternates between white and amber. Now on my left turn signal, I still have the stock bulb installed, so it flashes regular. Now on my right side, I just changed to LED, and you see how it flashes really fast, so this is what's hyper flashing. So in order to fix that, you have to install either load resistors, or change out the relay if you can, or install some sort of plug and play harness. On my particular vehicle, I'm just going to use the plug and play harness that I have. And I just need to connect it to the rear turn signal socket, which is right here. And I can go ahead and plug this in. And then take the other end and install it into the rear turn signal socket. And I'm done. And now with the plug and play harness installed, it's back to regular. Alright, the driver's side is stock. The passenger side is a new LED. As you can see, the passenger side is more intense. The light output, look at all this amber light right here, while the stock one is not so much. Alright, so that completes the product review, installation, and demo 
of the switchback LEDs from Ala Lightning. I'll have the product link in the description below, so go check it out. As always, don't forget to follow me on social media, Facebook and Instagram, where I do free giveaways for my YouTube subscribers every month. And as always, thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe for more videos. Thank you.